got a bunch of ice here that's building up in the bottom of this freezer. Keeps wanting to push the door open. Let's get some of this stuff out of here and see if we can find out what the problem is. Okay guys, so what we've got here, we've got a we've got a excuse me, a Kenmore. Alright. And I don't know if you can tell, but that just it's pushing this ice is building up and it's pushing the door open. Okay, now back in there there's a drain. Right in there somewhere. Um that we have to get to to uh, um, unclog that drain. Now as you can see this has been like this for a while apparently and uh, so I can't get that basket out of there. So what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to try to thaw this out somehow. I'll probably use a hair dryer. I don't want to use a heat gun. Don't ever use a heat gun because it'll melt this plastic. And as you can see when you open the door the gnats are flying in getting stuck to that ice. That's freaking nasty. So, but right up in here there should be a drain plug. I might be able to get to it from the back um, a lot easier. But right now first, what I'm, I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to try to thaw this out and get this basket out of here. So let me get a hair dryer. I'm going to thaw it out and I'll get back with you as soon as I get this basket out of here. Okay. It didn't take but maybe five minutes and as you can see maybe I've got this loose I think I might be able to see it's catching up there on the top so I'm going to go ahead and get this yanked out of here Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get this yanked out, and then we'll see if we can see anything from the back there. If not, we'll pull the refrigerator out. It is on wheels, and uh, we'll see if we can't find that drain. You're supposed to clean them out once a year, uh, them drains, and I'll show you what they look like if we have to take it out. All right, guys, I'll show you what I did. A couple screws. There's one there, one there, two in the back. There's four all together. So I took the two front screws out, so that way this thing could raise up and it gave me enough room to bring that out. Uh, the big block of ice. Now up in here, I've seen guys use uh, warm water. Uh, it looks like the drain is probably over in there. But I don't want to do that, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to close this up. I'm going to back this refrigerator out of here. We're going to go in from the back. From the back and see what we can see okay okay guys we got it unplugged there's the little drain hole I was talking about right there so what I did was I poured a bunch of warm water on there uh, just hot out of the spigot will be fine but um just kind of like let it uh what this it's these these freezers that are self defrosting they're all the same what that does is it runs down in to a pan that is down underneath here now unfortunately there's not enough room for me to get you back in there and show you but what it does it sits in that pan and then the heat from the motor and everything because it gets warm back in there it evaporates the water that's in that pan so all it was was it just got plugged up there and you should clean these out once a year just got plugged up and froze up in there so that's what happened to that so get this in here just like that okay now we're gonna <clears throat> I'm gonna go ahead and finish letting that thaw out I took the basket outside as you'll see at the end clip and it's thawing out so once that thaws out um, then I can put it back in here but you're done but that's how that works I just can't get you back up under there to show you the pan but it's directly under here there's a little tube that hooks on them now these are all pretty much the same these self defrosters they'll have 
have some kind of drain tube back in there. This one was easier to get to from right here. Some of them were back farther. But there you go, that's how that's done. So we got it fixed and I'll just have to clean it out once a year and uh, we'll be good. So there you go, there's how to, if you're building up ice at the bottom of your freezer, <clears throat> that's probably, it's probably a, a plug in that, in that drain plug there. It's probably clogged up, so there you go. Hope this helps someone. Shea Bear, the Myth Man Legend, gone for now. Bye bye, guys. A lot of ice there. One good thing we're in Florida. Should melt in no time.